Yep. All right. Oh, but, oh. oh no. I've cocked it up. I'll edit that bit out. Yep. Back out. This time, we're on a late one here. The weather's turned murky. So, we're going to head up, we're probably setting up in the dark. And, just to announce the big news, the big news. That's him. I'm back. <laughs> he's back. I'm he's back. Al he's alive. I'm still here. <laughs> yeah. Waiting to go. Yeah. Right. He's alive. After everything. Right. Back on it. So everybody that was concerned about him, there he is. Alright, alive and well. Back at it. I don't know how I'm going to get on with this light. Oh, this is a steepest. This is a bit of a test This is probably the steepest That's climb right. I could have found. <laughs> so, we'll just head up to follow the path. It's not far, but it is steep. Some nice views. All the rest of it. Right, we'll come back when we're halfway up, puffing and panting. See if I can... So if I can kill him off. That's a right little beast, it's like a little robot. <laughs> well, we didn't do any filming because it took about 20 minutes to get up. And here we are, this is the top. It's the views. It's all about them. We're just gonna pitch here, I'm gonna go there. Rob's gonna just be behind us, it's two little dry, dry patches there, it's flat, so it's a good spot. I've camped there before and there, and I've also pitched here. So oh, there's, there's enough spaces. Over there is Blaine Cathra. You can see Blaine Cathra and Great Malfell is in, in the cloud there somewhere. Penrith over there. Ullswater. Oh, Penrith's over that way. Ullswater there. Some wee cloud. And then a wee lab. He got up. He got up and he bothered, man. Is that wrong with him? Did. He's been putting it on. You were putting it on for um, <laughs> sim wanting sympathy. That's what it was. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to get set up. I've got a new tent. I've paid for this one. That's so, no, no, I'll be able to give it a decent review. I just fancied a bigger, right, a bigger space, and and it was um, I got that for 140 pound less than what you would normally pay in the shop, and it's brand new. Still got the tags on it. So I call that a bit of a bargain. Prawn cracker. There we go. New tent. It needs a bit of fettling like, but it's up for now. Just needs pulling out a bit here. But I like the tunnel tents, you know. It's a good design. I got a cheap. So there you go, keep your eye on eBay for bargains. Bargains, I say. It is a bargain. Feels lovely, feels nice, feels quality that. The inside the bathtub's really thick. There's a Robin, he's uh and he's Una. Popular tent this. People are, people are loving the Unas at the minute. For loving them. Mm -hmm. oh, the They're becoming popular. <laughs> they are popular like now. Now is the time to sell. No, never. <laughs> never. <laughs> he got that cheap as well. He got that bit of a bargain as well. Bargain hunters here, like. Bargain hunters. <sighs> so there we are. We're all set up. Just got to empty my bag. Straighten that up a bit. Looks a bit skew if. Maybe it's a second, you know, maybe it's got a fault, that's why it was cheap. Because look at that, the back of it. Uh, maybe. Yeah. Even so, it's still. Aye. I normally p end up pitching it in the garden to get it spot on. Because we just wanted to get them up here, like we just wanted to pitch. Because the weather's coming in. Right. Get this all sorted out and I'll come back. For some exciting things, I don't know what, like, probably now. Ah, so I've just realised I've left me mushroom, me black scene, and me mashed potato in the down in the van. Uh, I can't believe it. So all I've got is a steak, 
and some some meat selections a few pork pies a few beers west coast ipa heathen what's cooler than being cool and somebody threw this at us they threw it hardukan and a couple of brew dogs yeah oh, man I can't believe I forgot my mashed potato. It's nice and here, like. Look at that. Nice and cosy. Get two people in. And you'd have to have a, a doggy there. I can't believe I've forgot my stuff, like. I cannot believe it. I hit the gloves on the feet. Very nice. So, anyway, I've got me. Just turn around. I've got me Rab 900 out. It was a bit chilly last week. That should be alright for this. Well, it's not cold, like, it's not really cold. I've got the light too much. I need, need a silver foil mat for this. Possibly a footprint. Yeah, that's good. It's nice and big, this tent. Like So, England have just been beaten by Australia in the last seconds in the rugby. Unbelievable, Jeff. I'm going to get... Uh, I'm going to get out and I might have a beer. It's getting dark already. It's only five o'clock. Why we we're... In a, um, we've been enveloped by a cloud. Look at that man. We're standing out drinking beer. We're standing out chinning IPAs. This isn't the Craig Charles. It's just like the old days, man. It's just like the good old days, isn't it? It is. We're back, man. We're back. We're back in business. We really are. Rob's just taking his arthritis pills. <laughs> I've just had to put me um <laughs> me me support hose on. <laughs> the tent's getting drenched. Everything's soaking. It's that um the mist off the cloud. It's just soaking everything, but uh, the hell with it. Dries. I've learned it dries off. I'm um, looking the tent, it's a bit it's a bit odd though. I'm gonna have to set it up in the garden to see if I've done something wrong. So it doesn't look right. The front pole doesn't look right. They're colour coded so you can't get it wrong. But it doesn't look uh I dunno. I'll work it out. I always do. But for now we're just sitting out right standing out, talking shite, drinking beer at the truth point in the rain. Listen to Craig Charles. Well, here we are at the trig point, the point of no return. How was you? Um, I'll just hold on. I'll just trip over. How was your first camp out back since your illness? Oh, it's brilliant, man! Excellent. It's a bit um, drafty, like, isn't it? It's terrific. It's yeah. never stopped rain. See the cloud. Look at the cloud passing by. It's, it's been all right, though. We're in the clouds, like. Well, it's good to be back out, to be fair. Yeah, no, it is. Doesn't what the weather's like. It's just nice to be back out. I don't think I'll ever see you again. I thought that's yeah, it. I, I thought he's dead. Me, me neither. I thought you were dead. I was thinking the legs are just never going to make it again. I like, thought I'd be pushing. Drag me up a hill again. Pushing up here in a wheelchair. But no, he's back. It's resilient, that. <clears throat> Scottish grit, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, Scottish grit. It must be. It's got to be. It's the only excuse. <laughs> right. Enough about him. Uh, turn this around. Turn it on to me. Ooh. I look like uh, the gatekeeper. Because we scream like it. The gatekeeper. Okay. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> out of, it was out with Bill and Ted, wasn't it? Anyway, so we're having a great time. Um, we're going to get with bait on soon. I forgot all my stuff, I mean ingredients, I forgot me 
mashed potato and my black seen. So I'm just basically having a steak. But you know, it could be worse. Could be worse. Aye. I don't know how it could be worse, but it could be worse. It could be windy. It could be windy, right? Aye, that's it's the no thing. No wind whatsoever. It's zero wind night. I don't know how this would perform in the wind. Because it's a bit loose. I'm going to have to put it up in the garden and muck about with it. But that was just the first setup that, so I think it's all right. It's gone up all right. Rob's in the Una. Everybody's loving them. Yeah, that should have been mine, that. I have actually just bought another new tent today. Yep, I bought another tent. We're going to have to um, wait until we get some bad weather before I test that one. It's a uh, second-hand tent, right? And it's got a damaged pole and a little tear in the pole sleeve. So I'll just go do a few running repairs. But it's a beast, isn't it? It is. It's a hell of a thing. Wait till you see it. It's mad. I keep it for a big surprise. Get ready for a big <laughs> surprise. <laughs> yeah, I've lost it. I've gone mad. <laughs> Neat. So... That's it really, just catching up. Here we are, we're uh, standing up on the hill. Oh, I've stopped now. Here we go. World War Three is broken out. Yes! Trump's done it. He's pushed the button. <laughs> ah, there was loads of them before, it was mint. Lighten up this guy. Ah, nothing's happening. You're not seeing it. See, oh, look there. There, it is. It's World War Three. Oh my god. Luckily, we're up here, so we'll be safe. We're in with bomb shelters, aren't we? We are. So we'll be reet. Yeah. We'll be reet. Nah, there's not any more flashes. Ah. Yeah, see when the barns stop. Because they're in, they're in time now. Yeah. Look at that. Still gone, look. Alright. So the flashes have stopped, but the sound is still going. If we think it's the thick air, it's slowing down the speed of sound. Here we're going. We've got, right, Morrisons have started doing a nice 30 day mature steak. I've got the pan on, the old pan. No, don't, don't pinch other people's catchphrases. Um, I forgot my Blexine and the mashed potato man. Man, what the hell? What all about? And some of these pork pies, you know, are the ones with the pickle on top. Nice. So I've got some cooked meats, so I'm going to get this steak on. Where's my tongs? Where's my peats? The old peats. Salted it up. Get it in. Boom! Get that. This is a rump steak. Short horn rump steak. I'll come back when this is on the well, just when, whenever, I don't know, I don't know what I'm talking about. Just making it up again. There we go. It's done. Let's turn that off. It's done. A little bit of char grilling on it. Other than, uh, nice. Obvious, and then we're going to get back outside and talk more rubbish. We've got two beers left. Um, and some bits and bobs. And that's it, really. Nice mistake without the black scene and mashed potato. I was going to have a right meal. Bloody hell. Nice bit of pink. Lovely. That's perfect for me, that. 
Not everybody's cup of tea, but you know. Am I on? Am I on? No, I'm on. Great. Well, we've drank too much beer. We've talked absolute rubbish. We've had a good night talking rubbish, haven't we? Oh, we have. It's been fucking built up. Uh, what? Honestly, it's like. It's like being with people less fortunate than myself. <laughs> anyway, we've had a oh, we've had a mad night. We've been on the uh, the beer, and we've talked a lot of rubbish. I don't know. Be like the old days. Honestly, this is like this is like one of the old days camps. This is like how it used to be when we used to have a right good laugh. We always have a good laugh, but this was just, it, it was different, wasn't it? It was just weird. It was, uh, it was, it was, it was like the old days, like the good old days. Good days, mine, not, not negative. Anyway, so we're going to go to bed now. Um, we'll see you in the morning for the Hello Campers. This is the morning, the very next day. All that kind of thing. So, yeah, that's it. So we'll see you. We'll see you in the morning. You know, morning, morning. I'm from Blackpool, right? Blackpool. This tent's mint, by the way. Full, full, solid inner. Four season, four season inner. Is it a four season tent? I don't know, like, I don't think it is. Morning. It is the morning. It's the next day. It's tomorrow. Look at the look at the strange cloud right over there. Bizarre, strange day. Bit breezy, like. Wind's picked up a bit. This is all right. I need to fettle it. But it's all right. Tunnel tent standard design. It's standing firm. So we're gonna put the kettle on and have a cup of tea or something and then get off this hill before we get caught. So that's the inner. The porch is quite big like it's a good porch that and you can uh, you can pull these out, peg them back so you've got wider porch. Obviously Unpeg them, put them back with a shut in the door. The door won't close if you got them pulled out. But it's good. 16 pegs, I've just counted. I didn't peg these sides here. Rob's give us a tip on pitching the back first, peg the back out, <laughs> back out, put the poles in, and then pull it from the front, like lift it up. He had a nallow, that's how he used to do his nallow. And it's the same kind of shape in it. But yeah, it's good. I like it. It's very nice and waterproof. But as it should be. 3000 hydrostatic. The floor in there, 8000 hydrostatic. It's a really nice thick floor. I might get a footprint to come out into the porch. I like a, uh, a footprint in the porch. Cause you know when you're getting in and you're kneeling down i was getting wet knees yesterday so i like a footprint so i might get that out of stock last time i looked but it's done well i like it i like a nice tunnel tent it's nice and big it's roomy this has been fine just look at these clouds here it's amazing a bit up high really high you get good inversions today like got to be very high to get them because it's quite low it's sort of over there oh, anyway had a good night last night singing and dancing if you've lost a pair of specs they're here <laughs> oh, look at the scenery
So here we are. So I was good spot. Just off the jig. Rubs here. I don't put in the because the wind's picking up. He's having a nightmare. <laughs> as soon as he took the guy lanes out, the wind just came out of nowhere. <laughs> so did you enjoy that? Aye, good like. Yeah, next your first camp back out. Aye, whatever. Nice. Good laugh last night, wasn't it? Alright, well I'm gonna stop filming here because I'm put my gloves on, my hands freezing. And we'll see you on the next one. I'll leave you with an inspirational quote, right? And that is it's no good chasing rainbows unless you go out in the rain. And you know who said that? Dolly Parton. And people say that she's just a big pair of...